Hello everybody, welcome back to the Mega Modded series. We're jumping in again and we are randomizing our character as Tainted Lilith. Oh, a fun one. One that I can dominate as. And we've done basically nothing as her, because apparently I died as her last time. How did that happen? I don't know. Well, we'll see how this goes, but we should be on for a reasonably good run here. Um, this is a character of which I, I hold very dear to my heart, just because... I don't know, she's one of those characters where, like, she's so powerful, but it's not that she's so powerful that I love, it's that she can just blast through the first, like, two or three floors, which normally are kind of like, I, I wouldn't say they're boring, but as a total, they're the most boring part of a run. Uh, that is a mimic. But yeah, they're like the most boring part of a run because, um... You just, ooh, oh, there's a lot of good stuff here. That is, oh, need a bomb real bad. That's a look upgrade and, well, these guys can be champions, interesting. That's a look upgrade and a saucy, saucy tinted rock. So I would very much like a bomb, but we'll see if we get one. We did, huzzah. But yeah, they're not boring as such, but obviously you don't really have items and stuff, so they're not as good as everything else. That's... That's more of a look upgrade than I was expecting, I'll be honest. <laughs> All right then. All right then. Let's uh let's continue on. Shoot the whoop here by the way is going to be very nice. Um the more damage we get, the more damage it does to seven times your tier damage, I believe. Is it seven times or is it 11 times? I think it's seven. But anyways, as for the question of the day today, as for the question of the day today, where is somewhere where is somewhere in another country that you like you'd really like to go? Like whether it be like um, a monument of that country, um, like somewhere in nature, or even just like if there's a restaurant there that you really would love to try. Um, I, like for me, I've got a couple of different, different ones. I I kind of, me, me and my girlfriend, um, we've been together about eight and a half years now. And obviously sort of within the next few years, we'll probably get married. I don't know. We've not really planned it, um, but it'll, it'll happen at some point. But we, the only thing we've really planned for definite is that whatever we do for a honeymoon will just be um, a trip to America for like three weeks where we visit a few states because I've never been to America before. She has, but when she was younger, when she was like 13. Um, but I've never been, so I'm like, hell yeah, I want to go to America. Uh, was there something to bomb over here? I feel like there was. Kind of? Um, yeah, I really want to go. Um, and so I, I, I just said do like a three-week trip where we go to like a different state each week so i'd love to like go see the grand canyon and stuff like that that'd be pretty awesome I'd, I'd really like to go to new zealand as well i think i've mentioned this before but the landscapes in new zealand and surprisingly to some people it's not because i'm a lord of the rings fan i've actually never seen lord of the rings in my entire life and i really don't know why it's like i don't have an aversion to it i like that sort of film i've just never tried them are we really not gonna get any keys this floor is it really gonna bestow that upon us that would be truly despicable. Uh, but yeah, I'm going to say, like, New Zealand, it just, it's like the most beautiful place. The UK does have some really beautiful sights and stuff, but at the same time, yeah. We're really not going to get one, are we? I, I will check out the Devil Deal just because Mum's knife is incredible as this and I want it. Although, Damocles, I mean, y'all know I'm a sucker for Damocles. This doesn't give us any hearts, does it? Oh. That's such a good item as well. Um, y'all know I'm a sucker for Damocles. Um, let's see if we can get ourselves a key somehow. Which I actually don't think there's any way we can get ourselves a key. Which is annoying because we're missing out on the shop and the item room. The item room being Damocles as well. But I'll take a little look around. I probably should have bombed that to get the double bombs there. But that's what I was thinking of. There's a tinted rock right there. I'll have a little wander anyways. Damn. Okay. Looks like we're shit out of luck, really. Um, I think, yeah, I think we just go. Like, I, I, I would have loved to have grabbed an item room there, but planetarium chance, it ain't bad. Especially with Damocles, we could end up getting double planetarium, which would be interesting. Uh, but we'll keep moving on. But yeah, another thing that I really want to do as well, and this is probably comes as no surprise for people that have been long-time viewers, I want to go to America just to eat a lot of food. <laughs> There's just, like, I know that America basically grabs its food from every different culture. It's not really like America has much of its own culture in terms of food. It's kind of like 
an amalgamation of other stuff, which is similar to the UK, really. But there's just... Oh, my God. Perfect. If, as long as we get a key, that is. Um, I just... I really want to go there and, like... I've, I've watched so much, like, Man V Food when I was younger that I'd just love to... Um, ooh, both of these are top tier. Um... Yeah, I, I like. I've watched so much like Man V Food when I was younger and stuff that I'd just love to like go um, and do a lot of these like different food challenges and stuff. I know that sounds a bit sad, maybe, but oh my god, I'm so intrigued by all of that. Okay, we do have Terra now, which is fantastic because that takes away the worries we had with bombs. We do have to unfortunately do a bit of awkwardness to get around it, but it works. Interesting. I don't think Terra destroys these guys, does it? It does not. I didn't think it did. Um, although, I was going to say that we could use a bomb to get some extra... Ooh, we could get a tainted item here. Interesting. I will do a quick save in case it crashes, because these rooms do have a tendency to crash every now and again. It's unfortunate, but it is what it is. So I'm just going to quickly do that. Saved it exactly five minutes there, just so it saves our progress here in case it does crash. Um... Oh, we don't even have a key. We need two keys to get in there. I just realized we don't have either of those things. So, right now, that was a bit useless. Oh, there's... Game. <laughs> there's one key. Right, let's uh, destroy the mushrooms. That doesn't do anything for us. Do remember we can walk out of rooms as well. I keep forgetting that we can... Um, Kind of explore a little more if we so choose. I am trying my best right now to just not get hit, though, because I, I want to activate Damocles as late into the run as I possibly can. That was unintentional, but actually kind of worked out. Yeah, are we really not going to get any keys again? Is it going to do this to us? How, how did that not... How is that not breaking the wall sometimes? Apparently, yeah, the first shot just doesn't count sometimes, I guess. Yeah, we're really not going to get a key again, aren't we? That's that's sad. No shot for us yet again. No item room again, actually. Oh, okay, okay. You, you, you've, you've redeemed yourself, game. You've redeemed yourself. You gave me a golden key and you gave me a bunch of keys here anyways. Um, ooh, Deep Pockets is a must pick up. Um, I will check this out as well. Chaos Heart. Heals one red heart after five uses, has a chance to do the Mama Mega Explosion and remove um, an item. Unfortunately, these are both actives that I frankly don't care about because I don't have any uh, red hearts to heal. I'll take the map. Why not? Okay. Yeah, a little bit upsetting on this front. How How is this room below going to work with Damocles? I really don't know. I'll do a quick save again because we have completed quite a lot of the floor since. So let's just do that again. I know this is a bit annoying to watch. I apologize. But it is just a safety precaution just because of how the game can be sometimes. Precisely so. It crashed. Right. It, it, I don't know why it does it. Like, it seems to be really inconsistent. Some of the items it just crashes. And I really want to see what that is. That was like a... Uh, New version of Damocles by the looks of it, which sounds really interesting. I might have to go and find that and spawn that in for myself and remove regular Damocles. Um, just because I want to see him. Uh, yeah, it must be a mod incompatibility. I'm going to try it one more time here and hope it doesn't crash. But we'll see, we'll see. One more time. Didn't crash this time. Okay. Damocles may appear over the head of an enemy in an uncleared room. When uh, an enemy with Damocles over its head takes damage, Damocles falls and instantly kills them. See, now... I think... Okay, no, it didn't really work the way I wanted that to. Why, why is the fly in there? I guess I'll take both. Oh, I can't take both. Um, weird that there's flies in there. Anyways, we got it. Um, yeah, that's a little depressing. Like, I... <sighs> That's an interesting idea, but it's nowhere near as cool as Damocles, and I kind of wish I'd have just kept Damocles at this point, but I've no longer got the threat of dying looming above my head, so that's nice. It kind of, it sounds like Adam's rib. We'll take perfection here. We're hoping to not get hit anyways, and 18 luck. I think that's definitely um, something we want. 
But yeah, yeah, I, I still don't know why those rooms crash. I have reported it to the developer, but there wasn't really much the developer could do about it without, like, looking deep into my game files, which is obviously not really super viable. I also think as well that that version of Damocles, I took it because it's new, but with this character, it's not so good because we kind of insta-kill everything anyways. Like, it's, it's, it's a fly. <laughs> Thanks, Damocles, for helping me insta-kill that fly. I needed that. <laughs> it's just silly, but... I don't know, it's it's interesting. It's it, I have to say, for a tainted version of Damocles, I was kind of expecting it to be something a bit more dangerous to myself than basically taking away all of the risk of um all of the risk of Damocles and giving me a dam essentially a, a way to kill things instantly. Um Dimbulb. Ooh, golden Dimbulb is particularly saucy, but it won't be active very much, so. Freezer baby's good enough. But yeah, we lose our doubled items. We lose our chance to die. Oh, we got another one of these rooms. Oh, really? I did not see that enemy coming at all. Well, it means that we take Dimbled now, I guess. Um, okay. So, uh, yet again, we've got to do this rigmarole here. I just wish the game saved after each room rather than at the end of the floor. Okay, so, generates... You see? I don't know what happens. It's just, it's just annoying. Okay, I've fixed it by just spawning it outside the room. <laughs> Generates up to four additional rooms per floor. Rooms can be uh, normal or of any special room type. So we take that. Do it did not remove the map, so we'll just go remove map. Uh, is it is it treasure map? Is that the name of it? C54. It is, there you go. Okay, cool. We've basically got the same effect. It's very annoying that it keeps crashing. I, I really love the mod and I do not want to remove it. But yeah, it is an absolute pain in the stinker. Oh, marbles right off the bat. Thank you. Um, ooh, blessed leaf. I'm sorry, but I have to take blessed leaf. Really? Back to back machines? That's kind of crazy. Back to back machines is something you don't see very often. Uh, find a secret room here. Humbling bundle. We are getting some good luck here. Good luck indeed. Okay, be careful of these fellas. That was so stupid of me. Oh god, I've just realized my health is like incredibly low. Grab that. Both of them. And let's try and just re-roll and get some more soul hearts, shall we? I think we desperately need to do that. That is real Eden's Blessing. Huzzah! We've got one of the Eden's Blessings already. Can't do much in that room. Oh, dude! These little stupid things! <laughs> I will take a pill. It's a look down! God damn! That's so depressing. So depressing. Come on. There you go. I can get through into here. Oh my god, yes. This item shows up a lot, but it is insane. We haven't had the Damocles thing proc on bosses yet. On bosses, it seems like it could be real good. Yeah, that fire rate bonus is pretty wicked. Fire rate on this character is very important anyways. So just getting more of it's pretty top tier. You're pretty much burned, sir. Thank you, thank you. Lots more money. God, humbling bundle plus deep pockets is quite the combo. In fact, um, let's blow this up. Grab this money. Just to try and play one of the machines a bit more. Because we have two crane games available. And we've been reasonably lucky so far, so... Who's to say that we won't get lucky again? I don't think I want to play this one. That's Isaac is sad. I don't really care about that. This, however, is an insanely good item. And we got it. And the watermelon doesn't do much. I guess I'll try for Isaac is sad now. Oh, I was hoping for three in a row. That would have been 
quite the spectacle, actually, wouldn't it? That would have been quite the spectacle. Right, let's keep moving on. Let's keep on moving. I've been just playing recently, like, pretty badly, but, like, playing super risky. Like, I'm always super low HP. I don't know. It's, it's always fun to play a bit riskier. We're trying to make the series more difficult. It's fine. Eden's Blessing is back again. I don't think any of these give us HP, do they? No. Unfortunately not. Money equals power would have been pretty good with the Humbling Bundle Deep Pockets thing I was just talking about as well. So that's a bit of a shame. Ooh, double keys there is actually pretty useful. Oh, I could have just gone through the middle. I didn't realize. Ah, damn it. Really hoping for a soul heart or two there. Dude. <laughs> Instead, I get hit. What, did, what froze you then? Was it my freezer, baby? I didn't realize it could petrify things. I thought it could only freeze them. Anyhow. Um, oh, we uh, we gulped a trinket. Using a book gives you 20-20 for the current room. Um, prevents Dynamix from spawning. That sounds pretty useful to me, to be honest. I can't move here, so... <laughs> oh, you bastard. Don't you dare. Okay, thank God. <laughs> yeah, like, we're still killing things in one hit anyways. And oh my God, I'm just getting hit by everything. Please give me a bomb. Thank you. Oh my god. I mean, it, it's giving me items, so I can't be that mad. But we are destroying. But we are going to get a, an additional four rooms this floor, remember? Don't forget about that. That's kind of an interesting prospect, really. God, do you know this, Dam this Damocles thing? I imagine it'd be, like, insane with, like, soy milk. Because it just insta-kills the enemy. It hasn't really procced on that many enemies, but it, maybe it scales with luck. I'm not sure. It definitely doesn't scale with having two of the items. We do have two of them, and it didn't do anything. Oh, no, we didn't manage to pick up the second one, did we? It didn't let us. There you go. Managed to kill that guy instantly. Oh, look at all that money. God damn, I wish I could have got money equals power. Yet again, I'm at 1 HP. I don't know if we if there's a way to tell which rooms are the extra rooms. But it did say they can be of any type. So I imagine they kind of work like devil rooms a bit. No, thank you on that front. Oh god. The risky the risky biskiness of this run is scaring me a little. There is a lot of risky biskiness, and it is quite bum-clenching. Interesting room. Okay. Oh, this is bad. Okay, thank God, because I do not do well against those enemies. Oh, I forgot about this. Um, Bumbo is actually pretty good. I realized the piece of cheese was probably the better player there, um, considering... I desperately need HP. Oh, God. Mistakes were made coming in here, weren't they? God damn. Okay. Doesn't matter. Scratch card, please be good to me. The death card, it's not really that good to me. That... Oh, yeah, I'm so fucked. I'm so fucked. If he does that again, I'm dead. Thank the lords. <laughs> and we got HP out of that, too. My goodness, that was tricky. Okay, okay, okay. Let's go. We we might die. I've been playing poorly. I, I don't know. This run, I feel like I've not played terribly. At the start of the run as well, I was mocking myself for dying as Tainted Lilith. And now... It's cursed to happen again. You have all of that, big boy. These guys do full heart damage. Do not let them touch me. These chests have been very lucrative for us so far.
Really? You're going to create two hosts? Check this out. Ooh, some cell babies is kind of nice. Oh, I love the fact that they're the little gallows. Yeah, you get damage, pleased, boy. I need to look for black hearts here or like good cards. You're not really what I'm looking for. Oh my god, it's just scary. I am just clenching. This room is a pain in the ass, if I remember correctly, as well. Oh god, these, these blocks do not move how I thought they would. I thought they'd be the ones that latch to the walls and kind of do their own thing. No, they're not. Damn you, you stupid things. Hey, I'm sorry, dude. I need this money. That is pretty nice. What's that going to give us? 20 cent. I mean, it's it's technically completely worth it. I kind of need to grab as much of this as I can without him stealing everything. Just because I need reroll money. I need soul hearts, like, desperately. I need soul hearts, like, desperately. I need soul hearts, like, desperately. Thank you. Okay. Hmm. I think shoot the whip's still better. Upgrade my freezer, baby, while we're here as well. Why not? Did oh, 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 I got stuck behind that death's head then. <laughs> this is be scary. But that damage upgrade there. That is, that is quite nice for us. Wait, what? Uh, I was like, we... Where's the enemy? Turns out there's just an incredibly minuscule boy. But Damocles went off almost killing him. Oh, come on now. That would have been good to know about prior to spending all my money. I realize I'm stealing some of your coinage, big boy, but it has to be done. I need some of it. Really? What? Why? How? What is the chances of getting a host? Because I swear it's like a million. Oh, dude, I just walked right into that. Why? Come on, my big bumbo boy. He's looking very voluptuous. This is bad. Oh my god, I panic. I panic used then. Oh, hello. Um. Well, for starters, yes. That is a must. I kind of wanted some other stuff from there, but sinus infection is just too good to pass up on. That's also good. We might get a transformation here. Ah, oh, no. We don't, we don't have any transformation pieces yet, apparently. Okay. Health is actually looking a little better now. Do remember that every motherfucker is going to be a champion. I keep forgetting that. Okay, get some of those bugger tears on there. Bumbo, don't you dare throw bombs at me. It's such a troll that max level Bumbo just <laughs> fucking yeets bombs out at you. Well, I just get one free devil deal. I mean, take that right now. And then grab this. Take a look at this. Grab that, I guess. And then check out this. Sprinkler. Nah. Not worth it. We've already done boss rush. Not worth it. Yeah, that judgment item, I remember it not being very good. But it's free, so why not? Oh, we got a mini boss up this way. God damn apology. You're so powerful. Nine lives. That is pretty good. Also, that means we are now one off guppy. We only need a single guppy item to actually become guppy, which is kind of nutty. 
Still haven't had any more Eden's blessings yet. Well, we've had we've, we've had a few being shown to us, but we haven't actually grabbed any yet. Yeah, you're going down, sir. I don't care about your invincibility. There you go. <laughs> it's just funny that the Damocles can target like a spider. It really should only target um, the, like, the highest HP enemy in the room. Or prioritize the highest HP enemy in the room, should I say. Whoopsie. Okay. That's rather nice. This little shopping item's been very good for us so far. Soul of Judas. Give me a bit of Judas in my life. we got PJs here, which kind of saves the day, to be honest. And nothing to get that with. Unfortunately, not many deep pockets procs. Deep pockets. Another mini boss up this way. Yes. Oh, that was stupid. I mean, we got a speed upgrade out of it, so I don't mind it. Yes, the health. It's coming very quickly towards us now. And with with this much damage, our, um, what's it called, is so good. Um, Shoop the Whoop. Shoop the Whoop is just incredible with this much damage. Dude, stay away from my pennies. These are my pennies. You are max rank. You get no food no more. Oh god, how did I not get hit then? Once you are max rank, you get no num nums. I'm sorry. It's just it's just the way it's gotta be. <laughs> this this that judgment item is just fucking stupid. <laughs> I don't know what pack it's from, but it needs <laughs> Very severely reworking. It spawns one enemy every now and again, and it's like, I don't really get why. <laughs> like, it's not difficult at all. It spawns a Bernie. Like, early game, it might be a bit, a bit more tricky, but for the most part, it really makes no difference. And it gives me, like, a penny, and it's like, okay, thanks, I guess, but I don't really understand why you did that. Okay, nice amount of bugger tears stuck to you. Good bomb placement, Bumbo. I both meant that sarcastically and not. Um, and then we're gonna... We haven't done Hush yet, have we? No, we, I think we should do Hush. I think we we have uh, a pretty decent run for Hush. It's not incredible, but bugger tears is normally good. Like, thank you for spawning an enemy there. It's dead and it gave me some bombs. Dude, it's such a troll that these chests can be replaced. They should be immune. Dig at X Max to spot in rooms to get unique items. Can only attempt to dig once per room. I guess I'll take that. I don't think it matters too much for us. Oh, wait. What the fuck? I got placenta. Where'd that come from? There you go, got a crawl space. Intriguing. Is this gonna exit us out? I'm gonna I'm gonna hold off on that until after I've beaten Hush. I feel like that's gonna error rumors. Typeset's really good here. Eden's blessing's really good here. Actually gives us a fire rate upgrade as well. I upgraded nine lives? What does that even mean? <laughs> Grab that, why not? Okay, so there's our X. Oh. Okay. No, that's not worth it at all. I was like, unique items. Nice. And it gave me two pennies. Like... Mm -mm. That's not really what I thought. I thought it meant, like, there'd be, like, one X per floor. 
that I could get an extra item out of with it being quality four. Although, and again, it is quality four, so maybe, maybe I just got unlucky. Maybe you can get items from it, or you can get some better stuff. I don't know. I'll, I'll stick with it. I, I, I don't. The shoot the whoop is good, but I don't need it. This shouldn't be too long of a fight. It's better when he spawns stuff because then we get a fire rate boost. Dude, there you go. Type set's rather nice here as well. My finger's getting very tired. I'm getting RSI. <laughs> Got him just below halfway already though. Really not seen any problems whatsoever with the run. Of course I bomb him right as he goes down. Bumbo's bombing him though. Like quite rapidly actually. He just planted three bombs in a row. He's actually doing a very good job. What a lad. More Bumbo, more. Keep the fire rate pumping. Oh my god, how did I not get hit by the beams then? I think Sack Dagger has saved me a few times. There you go. Easy breezy. Right. Let's go check out this room. I'm hoping it doesn't error room me, because that would be really sad. It did not. But it did bring me to a nearly useless room, which is, is a bit depressing. Yeah. Sad times. Okay. I'm going to keep my, my, my digging spoon. Otherwise known as a shovel. <laughs> I don't know why I called it a digging spoon. I just, like, in the moment I was like, I've already started the sentence, but I can't remember the name of it. I can't remember the word for shovel. So I was like, okay, I'm just going to have to commit. Digging spoon. I mean, I'm not wrong. It quite literally is a digging spoon. So we're gonna, like, we're gonna look for X's. Is there only one on the entire floor? Because that's what I thought. That was silly of me. Ah, oh, I didn't even finish that room. I keep forgetting I've got the item that lets me walk out of rooms. Then again... I do have the item that lets me walk out of rooms, because I don't have to deal with this anymore. I was trying to re-roll them out of being champions, then realized I have golden champion belt. Yeah, no. <laughs> I ain't messing around with that room. Soul heart there. We did not find our X. There it is. We got him. Oh, that was stupid. Also found a secret room. There's another X in here. A shovel. Not a shovel. A card. I'm dumb. Yeah, it doesn't seem great. <laughs> I've got to be honest, it does not seem quality for so far. Maybe I'm missing something. But it's given me a... I, like, I suppose over the course of a whole run, it could give you quite a lot. But I feel like humbling bundle is like infinitely better and it's not quality four i know that i know that the qualities aren't like definitive they don't a quality four doesn't instantly mean it's a game winning item but it should mean it's good and it, it seems it seems okay <laughs> i might be undervaluing it though like i said maybe you can get items from it and i've just been unlucky like if you get it early enough in a run it tends to be a bit more valuable maybe yeah, bumbo you do your thing weird playing this fight and it being at like 60 fps which is just super uncommon <laughs> there you go mother's love is unlocked mother's love is a very good item as well oh shit 
spawn him in this room. Why? Another Eden's Blessing, just in case. Oh, Super Meat Boy, hello. Okay, pretty good stuff. Just remember, we can just beeline it to the boss. We don't have to do any of this bullshit. Also, we can reroll Eternals. If we see Eternals and we do not like it, we can literally walk out the room and walk back in and they might not be Eternal anymore. Yeah, it's just pennies. <laughs> oh, there's a Dominic. I thought I had the trinket to stop that. <laughs> I obviously gave that up at some point. Okay. This is the way to do this. I, I always forget how good this item is in the chest. Just makes the chest free. There you go. There's only one room we have to actually complete here. Did he just dodge that Damocles by jumping? I think he did, didn't he? I'm actually kind of finding these monsters a little difficult. We got there in the end, though. Hard. I don't care. I realize I could probably could have got a lot more items with the look that I have by completing the rooms, but I feel like I would have lost a lot more health. I feel like I'd be in a way more difficult situation for this run right now. Sack dagger saving my life again there. I'm kind of purposely using it to block shots when I can. Bogatiers. Oh my god, yeah, Sack Dagger defensively is amazing. The more things you summon, the more damage I do, fella. I'm taking a lot of damage here, but I just don't care. I'm just face tanking him now. There you go. Oh, friendly Sack as well, and one of my favorite items. Some great items unlocked there. I hope you guys did enjoy this one, and I'll see you guys in the next one.